Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
Thank you for joining us this morning on Sunday morning due with Mama Kings. We do apologize for starting a bit late. Um, it was due to some technical issues beyond my control this morning, but I want to thank God for bringing you here this morning. Thank you for joining me. Thank you so much. In our usual fashion, we're just going to be giving God praise this morning, worshipping him because he deserves the glory. We worship you, Jesus. We worship you. Lord, we worship you. We worship you. Lord, we proclaim you now your mighty power and your awesome majesty. Lord, come upon us now and release your
join the host of heaven this morning. The 24 elders around the throne, the beasts, the innumerable company of angels bow down before you this morning. Lord, we worship you. We worship you. Spirit. 
provide us peace. Oh, I will open up inside. Provide a spirit. Oh, I'm inside. Feel me, up, Lord. Feel me, up, Lord. Feel me, up. Feel me. Feel me up, Lord. Feel me up, Lord. Feel me up, Lord. Feel me up. Feel me up, Lord. Feel me up, Lord. Feel this place take over the atmosphere Lord Father have your way here have your way Have your way, have your way, Lord, have your way, have your way, Lord, have your way. Peace. Mm-hmm. 
kingdom come let your will be done on earth as it's in heaven let your glory come shining like the sun Let your glory come Shine like the sun Your kingdom King of glory Mabrogo shanda halabaya He palazando lo boshi you for me 
is my worship all of my worship receive my worship all of my worship is my worship all of my worship receive my worship all of my worship you Lord, you are worthy and no one can worship you for me and all the things you've done for me Receive my worship, all of my worship, is my worship, all of my worship, receive my worship, all of my worship. i 
hallelujah belongs to you. My hallelujah belongs to you. My hallelujah belongs to you. Sing hallelujah, sing hallelujah. 
you are this morning with me even when you're going to be watching this later just bless him just get lost in his presence Your custom this morning, we're going to be praying some intercessory prayers.
This morning we're going to ask God, Father, we seek you. We seek an outpouring of your spirit. We seek an outpouring of your spirit. Lord, we seek an outpouring of your spirit, Lord. Because that's the only way we can manifest the power of the kingdom. Lord, fill us with your spirit. Lord, we will wait on you. Lord, fill us with your spirit. Fill us with your spirit. Fill us with your spirit. Your word says, those who are led by the spirit of God are the sons of God. The disciples could not do anything without the outpouring of the Holy Spirit on them. We ask the Lord God this morning, Father, fill us with your spirit. Let your spirit, O Lord God, come on us. Let it come like a mighty rushing wind. Let it descend on us like coals of fire this morning. Lord, let your spirit rest on us. Lord, we will wait, we will wait, we will wait on your spirit until your spirit comes. We will stay in your presence. Let us pray for the body of Christ. That's the next point of my prayer list. The church. Let us pray that there will be an outpour of the power of God in the church, even in this in these last days. Let there be fresh fire even in the body of Christ. A fresh zeal for the things of God. A fresh zeal to build the kingdom of God. A fire, Lord God, that nothing can quench. Your word says that you build your church and the gates of hell cannot prevail against it. Lord, build your church. Lord, make your church strong even in these last days to do your will, to build a kingdom for you. Help us win more souls for your kingdom. Help us dominate the kingdom of the earth. Till the kingdom of the earth becomes the kingdom of our God. Let us, even in our third point, thank God for the month of June. Thank God for bringing us to the month of June, that this month shall be a month of higher dimensions, greater blessings. And in the same breath, let us pray for the monarch of this land, the Queen of England, Queen Elizabeth II. Let's thank God for 70 years on the throne. Thank God for her life, thank God for her family. We thank you for what you have done through her, even in this nation, even in this world. We ask for strength for her, even, 
even as our age goes up God increase our strength in the name of Jesus we pray for good health for her Because we know you answer our prayers. Lord, we thank you because we know you've heard our prayers. And it's as it is our usual custom, we would take the Holy Communion so first I'd, I'd like to read the scripture to give it context so we don't just do this for doing sake we do it because we believe that Christ came, went on the cross of Calvary, died for our sake. And because of his death, we have access to God. We have direct access to the Father. And he has asked us to do this in remembrance of him. Every time we drink it, every time we drink from the cup, every time we eat the bread, we should do this in remembrance of him. So I'm reading from the book of 1 Corinthians 11, 23 to 30. This is Paul's message to the people in the church of Corinth. The message is still very relevant even today, many thousand years after. It says, For I received from the Lord what I also passed on to you. The Lord Jesus, on the night he was betrayed, took bread. And when he had given thanks, he broke it and said, This is my body, which is for you. Do this in remembrance of me. In the same way, after supper, he took the cup, saying, This, is, this cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this whenever you drink it, in remembrance of me. For, ne for whenever you eat this bread and drink this cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes. So then, whoever eats the bread or drinks the cup of the Lord in an unworthy manner will be guilty of sinning against the body and the blood of the Lord. Everyone ought to examine themselves before they eat of the bread and drink from the cup. For those who eat and drink without discerning the body of Christ eat and drink judgment on themselves. That is why many among you are weak and sick. And a number of you are falling asleep. This morning we're going to break bread as we've been instructed by the Lord. So I want you to grab a piece of bread and a drink and they are going to be emblems that will represent the body of Christ and the blood of Jesus. And as we eat it, we do this in remembrance of Christ who came to die for our sake, who was beaten, stripped naked, flogged and killed so that we might be set free from the power of sin and death. As we eat this, this morning, we remember you, Lord Jesus. And Lord, as we drink your blood, Lord God, let your blood energize us this morning. Let the spirit that raised Christ from the dead, that's in the blood of Jesus, let it quicken our mortal bodies this morning in the name of Jesus. Let it give us strength for the month. Let it give us power over every circumstance, every situation, power to walk in higher dimensions in the name of Jesus. You may eat the flesh and drink the blood. There is power, power, wonder walking power in the blood. A 
the land there is power power wonder walking power in the precious blood of the land even in this vein i sent prayers for one of my family friends sister ganiat who pray for healing for you this morning power and the blood of Jesus is available for you this morning. The Bible says he was wounded for your transgressions. He was bruised for your iniquities. The chastisement of your peace was upon him. Therefore by his stripes you are healed. We declare you healed in the name of Jesus wherever you are. We release ministering angels to you right now to bring the healing from the throne room even upon you in the name of Jesus. And I use you as a point of contact to everyone watching this stream, who will watch this stream in future, who is dealing with any form of sickness. I minister healing unto you in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. Thank you for joining me on Sunday morning due with Omo Kings. As you know, we gather here every morning on Sunday, 8 a.m. Just to worship God, to intercede and commune with each other. God is doing a new thing in our midst. He's brought us into the month of June. This month is our month of higher dimensions. Even as we we wait on the Lord to fill us up with His Spirit, I want you to 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 approach this month with the confidence that the Spirit of God gives us. The Bible says God has not given us the spirit of fear, but He has given us the spirit of love and of power and of a sound mind. I want you to obtain. The month of June with that spirit in you the spirit of God the spirit of love the spirit of power and of a sound mind this month go and do great things the Bible says they that know their God shall be strong and shall do exploits I want you to go in your work in your business in your education in your family whatever it is you do this month Go with the power of the Holy Spirit, the power that raised Christ from the dead. The Bible says when that power enters you, it will quicken your mortal bodies. Just go in the power of the Spirit this month. Mabala bo shananamando koloboya. I leave you under the dew of heaven this morning. May the dew of heaven rest on you this morning, even as you've taken our time to spend time in the presence of God this morning. May the dew of heaven rest on you. May the fatness of the land be your portion, even in this week, in this month. Go and conquer, go and do exploits. Mabro Koli Badayalamandos. Holy Spirit, we want to fellowship with you even on a deeper level this week. I want to fellowship with you on a deeper level this week. Fill me up, Lord God. Fill me up, Lord God. Let the channels of my spirit open up. Open up. And fill me, Lord. Fill us, Lord, with your spirit. Fill us with your spirit. Fill us with your spirit, Lord. Fill us with your spirit. Fill us with your spirit, your spirit, your spirit. And may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet, sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with us now and forevermore. And surely, God's goodness and mercies and favor 
and blessings shall follow us all the days of our life. And we will continually dwell in the presence of the Lord forever and forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever Amen. Thank you for joining me on Sunday morning due with former kings. Please like, share this video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel at Kings. You can follow me on Instagram at omokings247, on Facebook omokings247, on TikTok, on Twitter. Let us connect. I look forward to hearing your testimonies. Just give God praise with me this morning. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. See you same time, same station next week. God bless you.